What's going on YouTube? It is Greg Lock Fitness here and today's video is a comparison view versus the iPhone 6 and the Canon G7X. So there's the iPhone, there's the Canon recording the same footage. So straight away you can see the difference. The iPhone 6 is barely picking up any of the picture, especially in this dark light. And the Canon's doing extremely well, that's extremely well focused. So I think the Canon G7X wins on the dark lighting. Also if you look closely on the iPhone 6 it's very like jolty. There I'm jolting it around. Here when I jolt the Canon, that is extremely well, it's staying very stable. That's extremely impressive. And I'm not just saying this, both of the cameras are good but that is extremely impressive. Look you can't even see it anymore on the iPhone 6. It's gone. The lighting has gone. But on the Canon we have got it. So that is on the darkness. We are both recording in 1080p 60 frames per second. Okay, let's take a look at indoor lighting now. And we are back. This time we are indoors and straight away you can see the crispness and sharpness of the Canon G7X is destroying the iPhone 6 really. For some reason on iPhones when you go into the recording mode it likes to zoom in. So as you can see if I move the Canon straight over we are actually at the same distance from the hoodie. Okay, let's go in a little bit closer and see how the autofocus works. See if we stay focused in with the iPhone. Stay nicely focused with the Canon. Nicely focused again. Okay, let's bring them both back. Let the Canon autofocus. It's focused again. Okay. I do think I have to mess around a bit more with the settings on the camera so it focuses a bit quicker but let's go up and down. So as you can see again the iPhone 6 is having none of that but the Canon stays relatively focused on the objective or on the target I should say. Okay now let's go into the aerosol bottle see how we're going to go with this see if it keeps its focus. So it's extremely good, you can read that extremely clear. And now for the iPhone 6. Again, you can read that extremely clear. And back to the hoodie. So all in all, they're both very good cameras. The iPhone 6 is, is a good camera, 60 FPS, 1080p, same as the Canon. But you're never really going to match the Canon. It's never really going to beat it. But all in all, Good camera for a phone, it is a bit dark and it's grainy compared to a compact camera and the vibration control isn't as good. So out of 10 I would rate the iPhone 6 a 6 out of 10 for a phone camera it is very good but like I said it's dark, grainy and the shaky isn't that good. The Canon I've got to rate it a 10 out of 10, a solid 10 out of 10, it's extremely good. The focus on it is brilliant. Get that really good there. And comparing it to the iPhone 6. You know, it just destroys it really. So thanks a lot for watching guys. This has been the Canon G7X versus the iPhone 6. Peace!